What's up everybody? So if you don't know me, my name is Malia. I make nursing, pre-nursing videos, school videos. I make lifestyle videos, gym videos, mom videos, all types of videos, just everything regarding my life videos um and if you saw my last video i actually started a new journey um and i will be filming all of it uh and it's my hair so just a quick overview i was i went natural in i believe 2014 i cut it all off and I grew it out to what it is now, but 99% of the last five-ish years I have had in protective styles. So box braids, Havana twists, what have you, things like that. Um, so for the next year from now until February, I will be working on just caring for my natural hair. Um, and seeing how so in today's video we are actually going to be blow drying my hair and um not sure if you guys can notice it but um hopefully you can the quality in these videos look a little different because um my fiance purchased me a brand new vlogging camera and I am ex I'm just so excited I am so excited I have so many ideas just to record now because I have like a better camera like a designated camera for it and I'm just it's the camera I always wanted I'm super excited so without further ado let's get into and I'm sorry about the lighting it's clouds coming um without further ado let's get into the video so we are starting with freshly washed hair um, this is what it looks like. It has conditioner in it. Um, I do blow dry with conditioner um, in my hair. Very prepped hair. I kind of treat it as though it's a regular day that I just wash my hair and I'm, you know, caring for it. Especially if I'm putting heat on my hair, I try to make sure that it is well taken care of. I don't use a specific heat protectant because if you take care of your hair um, before you put heat on it, that is the heat protectant. Um, so that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna take my wide tooth comb and I'm going to just quickly separate my hair into four sections and clip them away and I will blow dry in those sections. I actually got these, I've never went to Sally's. I went to Sally's for the first time yesterday and I purchased these clips. Um, this is the brand. So this is my first time using them. I will let you know if I like them. All right, so let me move back a little bit. So I am kind of in a time crunch because you guys probably know by now because I think I'll be posting a video shortly. Um, but I am pregnant. I am in the very end of my first trimester and I have my scan today at 345 it's currently 12 noon exactly and I need to stop make a stop or two but um yeah so this is I'm combing this section starting from the bottom and very gently but firmly if that makes any sense just combing out this section because I don't want any I don't want to break any strands so I'm just being very gentle I'm trying to get my hair very detangled so it is easier to blow dry so this one is all detangled I am going to just quickly twist to prevent any more tangles since I just tangled it 
not twisting it like super neat or anything just taking two strands of the hair and twisting it and I'm going to take one of these clips and just clip it there like that I'm probably going to start with the back of my hair so I will go ahead and tangle all of these sections and then I will come back Okay guys, so I went ahead and I sectioned the rest of my hair in these three sections. This is the section I will be working with. I actually decided to do the front instead of the back first just because I'm trying to show you guys what I'm doing. So, and I'm on a time crunch. <laughs> it is 12.15, so I didn't take that long to detangle. And actually, I'm really excited because this is the comb. There's like nothing on it. Um, no shed hairs, which is fantastic. I love that for me. Um, all right, so what I'm going to quickly do is I'm separating this section because it is quite a large section. And I'm just going to tiny twist this. and um a pro tip because <laughs> I would consider myself a pro at doing this because I feel like I've been doing this for a million years and it works very well for me but anyway um a little tip is to keep a water bottle on hand um because it's actually a lot easier to blow dry your hair and it comes out a lot better if you start from wet or like very damp hair so this is the section that I'm going to be working with and it has conditioner in it I'm going to just lightly spray it just to give it a little bit more as you can see I can run my fingers through this perfectly fine no struggles and I'm gonna take this oil um, I'm like running out but I got have had this I feel like for like maybe two years um, granted my hair isn't out ever really so that's why um, I do use this on my daughter's hair too um, so I'm just gonna quickly oh this is open all right, so I don't even think I have to spray it because I have so much oil that's on it. Uh, whatever. We're just going to lightly spray it. All right, we're just going to lightly spray this piece and put that in, rub that in, and we're ready to blow dry. So I keep a brush. <laughs> For all the Harry Potter fans out there, this is a Slytherin brush. So I'm just going to take this and blow dry it. So first I start off using the tension method. So I'll pull it taut like this, not super tight so that it hurts. You're just pulling it taut, giving it that stretch. And then I will use follow up with a brush. very first section that I'm doing um and that's about how straight it is so it's giving straight it's giving nice job Malia that's what it's giving it's giving good job so I'm gonna go ahead and move on to this section again these sections are already detangled so I'm gonna 
nicely undo it from this tiny twist quickly run over it again to just make sure that we are still detangled and then I'm going to spray it being careful not to spray the other section that I just blow dried because then it would be for nothing uh, and I'm gonna just rub in that water that I just sprayed and then I'm gonna take this and the spray spray it and then rub that in. Again, pull it taut. And we're gonna blow dry this section. So now we have this whole quadrant done, the whole front section. And this is how it looks. So it's now 1225, it's been 10 minutes. We got this one section done so I should hoping to have finished the entire my entire head by before one o'clock we're gonna go with before one o'clock should only take me like not even 10 minutes to do one section so I'm just gonna twist this just to keep it out the way a little bit and move on so i'm not going to show you guys the whole head because that would be super tedious i will go ahead do the rest of my head and i will come back and show you what the final product is all right guys so we're done um this is what it looks like it is fully blow dried and it's 12.52, so I actually did finish before one, and I'm so excited that it's done and blow-dried. Like, it looks very good, very healthy, very full. Um, I'm really excited. So, I don't know how I'm going to wear it, but, like, look at her. She looks so good. Okay, guys, so that is my entire blow dry routine um i literally do this every single time and it comes out pretty much the same every single time um it's not super blown out straight i don't really need it to be super straight so thank you guys so much for watching um uh, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button we will be doing a whole lot of videos including hair videos going forward uh and if you have any questions or comments or if I, you feel like I could change some things or you have some things to recommend, please don't hesitate to put them in the comment section down below. Can't talk. Thanks, guys. See you in the next video.